Hello, my name is Walter and welcome back to Gotham Season 3 Episode 17. Uh, this episode is called uh, Primal Riddle. Uh, that's right, Heroes Rise, the Primal Riddle. Uh, and a little, and a little, little. And in the last episode, we saw uh, Nigma finally get his name. Then Penguin kind of starting to get his revenge, but then um, uh, that guy, the big guy, um, kind of uh, thwarted him by you know betraying his trust and everything, which we kind of expected. Don't get me wrong. So uh, yeah, I'm just gonna set up the video here so that we can be ready. Um, and uh, yeah, we uh, watched. Um, Bruce training with uh, the old guy whom we don't really know his name yet so yeah without further ado let's go um, I'm gonna keep it in um, I'm gonna keep it in uh, this form because uh, usually uh, it kind of lag so I'm just gonna watch it so nice Yeah, yeah, yeah. In the last episode too, uh, we saw we saw uh, we saw Frank Gordon, which is his uncle, coming. So and uh, yeah, his his uncle killed himself, which is interesting, by the way. Yeah, I think Alfred is gonna learn uh, that uh, Bruce isn't who Bruce is anymore. I'm sorry if it's lagging a lot, like, sorry. I'm just watching the frame per second here. It's uh, Mr. Freeze. I know you're hell bent on getting revenge on Nigma and all. And forming an army of freaks is a great plan. I mean, it was my idea. Quiet. I think I hear something. Do you think it's him? I think he will. Yeah, that's a yes. Where are we? Where we are is not important, James. Mm. What matters is why you're here. I think both is important. Yes, I do. Frank murdered your father. But I need to 
Yeah, Harry, you can just keep the cover in front of I like the bowler hat. Some people don't like it, but yeah, I like it. She got beat pretty hard. That is true. Sorry, I gotta keep it on because somebody's outside and then my mom's outside and she's eating so. Sorry, I'm a bit soft.
Ooh, interesting. Checkmate, yep. Shall we go again? <laughs> Good game. No, from my experience. Yeah, I think Alfred does suspect something. I know, I know, it's a late part, but... I got that. Yay! One riddle for me.
closing scene of the theater help us? It doesn't. But it does help me more. Fully announce myself on the Gotham stage. If you'll forgive me, Ben. It's all about pizzazz. There, there, Tabitha. You'll get your time in the spotlight. Damn, I sound like Gallivan. <laughs> Can't see what it says. D I E. Oh, die. So yeah, makes sense. Just think about it. Sorry. Yes, it says die. Nice. Cannot be serious. I've seen mass graves moving in this place. <laughs> That's true.
Okay, sure. You've gotten attached to anyone, have you? Alfred? Perhaps. You've spoken fondly of him. No. I just want to know. The number is immaterial. What matters is that Gotham must fall. And because of your sacrifice, it will. Can we count on you? Yes. His BP's dropping. We need to stabilize him. Want to see our secure badge access only? No one gets in unless they're sick or dying. Important. I think we know this is the closest hospital to the mayor's office. We brought him right to him. Great, let him show his face. I got you all over the place. Uh, the back. Where's that coming from? Communications room, second floor. It's a trap. Oh. What's up? Now you must be wondering what I want from that ding dong, Aubrey James. Turns out, it has answers to a riddle. One that you put into motion when you sent Barbara down the dock at the night sea. Oh. A million dollar question, eh? Mr. Mayor, you're in no condition to go anywhere. Jim, tell me you got him. He wasn't there. The secret he's after is the court. I came to the guy before I shrieked. You better get back here quick. What is it? There was some kind of explosion. A lot of victims. I got a bad feeling. It's Hannah. Don't leave the mayor's side. Uh oh. No, it's Nigma. I knew it. Fuck. That's true, that's true. Oh man, we haven't seen much of him actually. That's all he can say, man. Yeah. Is a 
Bingo. Touchy, touchy. Little pigs, little pigs, <laughs> let me ride it. I don't know why I remember reading that line actually. Brucey. And I'm remembering the line because it's like, um, because of uh, Enigma. Sorry. <laughs> My mind. Breaks in mysterious ways. Mm -hmm. Well, I just came to feed my cat, so if you're not gonna leave, I am. I promised myself I'd stay away. That it would be safer that way, but things have changed. What are you talking about? Come on, <laughs> just don't be here when I get back. So then wait. Just say it, man. You're dying. Remember that doppelganger guy? Oh, the TV, right, right, right. I have a question. What is this mysterious court that controls the levers of power here in Gotham? Alvarez, go to Channel 7. Find out where Nigma's broadcasting from. Our dear mayor's head. Be blown to bits in order to keep their anonymity. <laughs> Are you watching the television? I am. The court. We will clean this up on our own, but there are too many eyes watching. However, this does afford us an opportunity, James. To prove my loyalty. You want me to find Nigma and bring him to you? I understand this puts you in a difficult position. I got you, fam. <laughs> if you decline, this conversation will be our last. The choice is yours. Yeah! <laughs> Face change. We can't be clogging up the lines. I'm actually expecting an important call. I want to know who runs Gotham. I have the answer. Come by the GCPD. I'll tell it to you. Yeah, I think I'll pass on that. You'll never know the truth. You think I told Barbara everything I know? You always were clever, Jim. Hey, hey, hey.
sit down, Aubrey. <laughs> nah, uh, uh, sit down, Aubrey. You said you had the answer I was looking for, Jim. It would be incredibly disappointing if this was all a ruse. Or so, for Mayor James. Just tell him what he wants. He talks too much. <laughs> Should probably just go ahead and blow him up. I'll have your bears pointing. I'm not bluffing, Jim. Neither is he. Yep. <laughs> nice. I didn't see this coming. But that doesn't change anything. I want to know who the court is. Robert Dice. Nigma, Nigma, Nigma. You want to know who runs Gotham? Then let Mayor James go. Take I'll take you to me. them. But if you pull that trigger. Fool me twice. You fool me twice. Shame on me. Well, that's just not gonna happen. We'll go unsolved. Fine. <laughs> I knew it. Knew you'd do it. Yeah, go, you fucking coward. This is changing. Not okay. So, who talks first? I talk first. You talk first. <laughs>
<laughs> Sorry, <laughs> just had to play that song. I considered you a friend. I can sneak up on you. We'll be right in front of you without you even knowing. But when I reveal myself, you will never be the same. What am I? I don't care. I had betrayal. That's how our friendship ends. But did he betray him? He didn't, bro. This is gonna not end well. Hello, Mr. Nigma. I hear you've been asking about us. How do I know you're real? Isn't that the point of a good mystery? We're never quite it's sure true. what to believe until the end. It's true. Gordon can put you up to this. I assure you, Detective Gordon had to be convinced to bring you here. But let me put it like this. That question, Professor Strange had you ask Bruce Wayne and Lucius Fox last year at Indian Hall. The one that has tortured you. The one you'll never be able to answer. That answer is with me. What now? Get in, and all your questions will be answered. Of course, a little trust goes a long way. A leap of faith, so to say. Hey, I did it! <laughs> ah, that was unintentional. You've made us proud, Detective Gordon. What are you going to do with him? Well, Probably gonna to kill him. Scary. Family fights. There's a question mark on your face. <laughs> There's a question mark on your face. Hey, Pangy, check it out. <laughs> the 
An episode, actually. I know what he wants to do. He wants to destroy Gotham on his own. Or probably kill everyone. Who knows? Either or. And probably kill Aubrey James, so. I know that's Ka uh, I know that's Selena Kyle, but what's happening? All the cats are surrounding her. Mr. Nigma, how good of you to join us? Oh, it's uh, Jim. Sorry. I thought we were gonna see more of Jim. Oh, I thought we were gonna see more of uh, Nigma. Sorry. <laughs> Getting your names confused. Guys. Oh, that's an epic way to end it. But is that the end? How it is. Alright, that was about it. Uh, yeah, that was really good. Um, yeah, I'm really sorry about the legs, uh, but yeah, yeah, Uh, yeah, that was about it. Um, yeah, so this episode really did have a lot of its old Gotham intrigue in it and putting it with the new stuff as well. So that's really cool for me because it's really nice to see them go back to kind of the the older story by uh, older storyboards, mixing it with the new storyboard. So that's something interesting that I've added into this, um, and I really lo I really like this episode. Uh, so. Yeah, I've nothing much to say. So Jim joined uh, the card ball, so that's gonna be more, uh, more bigger or uh, bigger role to play. Uh, uh, that has a bigger role to play in the next episode, uh, and the maybe the cat surrounding uh, Selena is definitely gonna be her arc into getting into um, Catwoman and all of that stuff. Uh, I'm intrigued to see how Nigma escapes because he's definitely got to become more of a bigger enemy and uh, I'm thinking that uh, maybe uh, Poison Ivy is gonna finally get into rage because he, there's still some of her childishness in there to be honest with you guys but I'm gonna say the biggest disappointment for me again is Lee Tompkins so I'm just I'm just sick of it like I'm just sick of people like not understanding things like just, just let it go, like, fuck Lee Thumbs, really, like, who, who does that to their own people, like, fucker. Anyway guys, that was about it, I will see you in The Flash, and maybe this, uh, maybe Supergirl, who knows, see you then.